Hi guys, happy Vlogmas day 15. The video I had planned for today did not work. I wanted to show you guys how I edit my Instagram photos, but anytime I try to screen record on my phone, it literally doesn't save. So I'm giving up on that. So I decided I'm going to do a um, what is my favorite beauty products right now because honestly I do have a bunch that I literally am swearing by right now. Okay, so I actually like don't have many beauty products that I like swear by only because I don't wear makeup 24-7 and like I don't constantly have things done to my hair. Like the fact that my hair is even straight right now is a miracle. It's because I just got it done on Friday and I don't, um, I very, I don't wash my hair, like, every day. I wash my hair once a week, maybe twice a week, which to some people that's probably disgusting, but that's actually one of the best things for your hair because it lets the natural oils and stuff, like, hydrate your hair. So, that's why I don't really have many hair products that I like, um, but I am going to show you two of the hair products that I do swear by. Um, this is the Tresemme, are you even going to be able to see because this light is in a bad spot. The Tresemme Dry Shampoo, what is it called? Between Washes. This stuff, I actually stole this, not this can, I stole like some of it from my sister. And I have never used a dry shampoo that was better than that one. Um, I used to use the Batiste. Like, everybody knows that brand, whatever it's called. It's like the green and white stripey bottle. I used to use that one, and it always made my hair feel weird. But this one actually makes my hair feel like there's nothing in it, which I love. Because when my hair is, like, starting to get greasy and I put dry shampoo in it, it almost gets, like, that stiff texture to it. So, I definitely recommend the Tresemme one. Um, and then the other hair product, oh my hair looks crazy now, the other hair product I definitely highly recommend is to get the Argan Oil, Moroccan Oil, literally freaking amazing. And, does it, oh it does smell good, sorry, I couldn't smell it good, but, um, this stuff is literally a miracle worker because I dye my hair so much now, um, I dye it like every three months to get my roots done and stuff. My hair has been feeling very, very dry. My friend Kerry actually got me into the argan oil. So I, what I do is when my hair is wet, I'll just put like the littlest, littlest dab into my hands and then I'll rub it all around my hair. And then I know some people say you're not supposed to put it at your roots, but because I don't, my hair does not get greasy, I will do like one little swipe through on my roots just to give it extra like oils to it. Um, so, so when when I do use this, I do have to usually wash my hair twice a week, which is fine. Um, but like I said, that's fine. Um, and then going on to my face products. Caroline's probably at my house because she was picking me up. Oh, she's on her way. Sorry. Um, is my Hoola bronzer. I swear to God, as much as I hate wearing face makeup, I've actually l been loving using this this is a humongous one i don't even know if you could see at the top it says limited edition because it's a 16 gram one so the regular original hula bronzer is eight grams and i got this for only 44 dollars um which is a freaking steal because normally the hula bronzer is like 32 or something so it should have been like this should have been like 60 dollars but it was only 44 so i definitely recommend this I've literally had this for like two or three months now and I've not even put a dent in it and I use it quite often. Um, so definitely recommend the Hoola bronzer. Um, and that's it for my face products. Um, now I have two items for my eyes. I have my L'Oreal Voluminous Mascara. It's in carbon black. If you guys watch my other videos, you know that I've been using this for quite some time now. Um, this is what I actually have on my eyelashes right now. Um, I just will curl my eyelashes and then I'll pop this on and it takes literally two seconds. The only one thing I've been noticing lately um, is that this does kind of run a little bit, which it never used to. So I don't know if like, it's because I'm using new face products that it's making my face a little extra oily, but 
Honestly, I don't even care. I love how this makes my eyelashes look and I like how long they stay for because sometimes I feel like at, at the end of a day having mascara on for eight plus hours, my eyelashes almost like get like all clumpy. So this does not happen. So I definitely recommend that. And then my other eye product is my falsies. I use the Ardell Demi Wispies and I literally swear by these. They're the faux mink ones. I don't get the ones that have like the really thick band. These are the Invisibands. So like as you can see it kind of looks like there's like um it's very very small the band. I don't like the ones that are really thick. Hello focus. I don't like the ones that are really thick because I feel like they do not stay on my eyelashes. I mean on my um eyelid. I feel like they flop off and then I'm like have half my eyelash waving in the wind so i definitely recommend those um these are a little bit dramatic some people will say i like them because i feel like they could pass as like kind of natural probably not to some people but whatever um i like these because i could i feel like i could wear those every day and won't look that ridiculous um and they also do kind of look like eyelash eyelash i'm talking too fast they do kind of look like eyelash extensions if you do put them on properly. Um, so, I definitely recommend those. They're not expensive at all. I get them from like CVS and I think this pack was like 12 bucks. Um, so yeah. And then my other beauty product that I like, I have one more after this, is my Burt's Bees Chapstick. I literally think I would die. High focus. The Burt's Bees chapstick. I would actually die with this without this. Like, it's not even a joke. My lips get so disgustingly chapped in the winter. I do not know why. I don't know. I think it's because I don't drink enough water in the day, to be honest. I probably don't drink enough water, and that's why my lips also get really chapped, because I'm, like, very dehydrated. But I definitely swear by the Burt's Bees, because it, like, just takes every gross thing off my lips, and it's all good. Um, but with that being said, I'm on to my last beauty product, and that is these, which I actually don't have on, so it's very ironic that I'm showing you these, but it's the Kiss Gel Fantasy Press-On Nails. This is one of my only packs that I don't have open. Um, so, the reason I don't have these on right now is only because I have wore them for, like, eight months. No, not eight months. I'm being, like, so dramatic. What am I even saying? For a few months, um, non-stop taking old ones off, putting new ones on, and it was, like, really starting to kill my nails, um, just because I was never letting them air out, so I am letting them air out, I'm gonna, um, put new ones on for New Year's Eve, um, but yeah, I definitely swear by these, they make your nails look so much nicer, this freaking box of nails cost me $9, and it lasts for two weeks, two to three weeks, depending on how well you put them on your nails there was one instance where i did rush to put them on like i didn't file them or anything and i didn't push back my cuticles and they were falling off like four days after i put them on but you know if you want them to stay on and if you want them to look nice you need to take the time to do them so i do recommend to like make sure you have at least an hour to do it just because you have to sit there and you have to figure out what nails fit your nails the best and then you have to organize them then you have to file down your nail and then push your cuticle back um but it's definitely worth it because you're saving so much money in the end and they look nice and they're easy to get so yeah that is it for my favorite everyday beauty my favorite beauty products as of right now i don't even know what to title this video um, cause like, as you saw before in the intro I had, uh, this was not even my plan for a video, but I'm actually kind of glad I thought of it, cause, I don't know, I feel like I always like seeing what people are into using and stuff, so, yeah. Have a great night, guys. I love you very much, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.